Hello everyone. Long time no see. Today, I want to share a simulation case about take a tap from a substrate. And in this case, I will use cohesive contact in this model. So, let's see what the mod look like. Here is a steel substrate and the other part is a sheet uh, which model the tap. So and the tap we gave a PVC or PE material property and the thickness is about um, 0 0.2 millimeter and the substrate is a steel block so I give a steel property solid section for this part and in the assembly I assemble these two parts in in this model and as we can see the top face is the tip and the green part is the substrate so to apply the displacement load I create a coupling here for this edge and then in the step module I create a static general step which take on the long geometry settings and then in the interaction we need to create a contact include the cohesive behavior of the contact pair and then we need to define the damage evolution and initiation criteria here then we create a contact pair for these two parts load module I fix this bottom surface of the substrate and give the reference point of displacement load and the displacement is in the x and the z direction so here Then we can create the mesh, and this is just for for shear. So the mesh is not very fine, but I just create them as there. So after we create the mesh, we can create a job and submit it. And for the mesh, I can show you for the substrate, we mesh it as C3D at reduced element. And for the shear, for the tap, we create it as S4R element tap. And the element size is the same. So we can create a job and submit it. After a little time, we can we can get this result. Here I will just go to the result. And I show you what the result look like. So 
here is the last increment of this simulation and we can see the animation and this is the stress we can also check the openings between the two parts which means the contact openings here and we can also create a crack displacement in this path so I can create a path load list and just to this load okay uh, it's it's not for the same part so Just to this node. So they're all for the substrate. And then we can create a path displacement. We can create a path point project onto mesh and it's a weird out point we need to use three okay and plot it so now we just create a curve for the displacement Okay, we can also get the force displacement curve. So I need to go into operate on x y data. So this is the force displacement curve in the first few increment the first layer element uh, first layer element of contact get failure and then the contact get cracked and here, here, it uh, just gets stable. So, here is the result of this simulation. If you are interested in CAE with Abacus, please subscribe my channel and I will share some simulation cases with everyone and get what you want here thank you for watching